Now's the chance to vote for your May Ride of the Month. Vote A for George Rook's strong effort on Lilandra at Bath. Positioned out wide, the pair began to make ground on the leaders. However, Rook looked in trouble when dropping his whip in the final furlong. Nevertheless, the jockey didn't panic, driving Lilandra out hands and heels to get home in front. Nearest to us is Lilandra with a chance as well. Headshot and Lilandra and Granary Queen, three flash bars together. Vote B for Ryan Moore's ride on Cleveland at Chester. Moore slotted Cleveland in behind early on, and the pair waited patiently on the rail for over a circuit. Turning for home, Moore edged his mount off the rail, timing his charge to perfection to win a thrilling tote Chester Cup. Up front, Paul Train. Here comes Cleveland, though, with a tremendous run on his outside. Paul Train and Cleveland. Cleveland getting up. Cleveland won it. Aiden O'Brien's had a dream week, and he wins his first Chester Cup. Vote C for Holly Doyle's fantastic ride on Brave Emperor at Chepstow. Slowly away from the stalls, Brave Emperor was green and Doyle had to encourage him out along in the opening strides. Brave Emperor in the Mike Blue wasn't the best away uh, towards the centre. It's given him three or four length start. The pair looked to be outpaced, but Doyle found a great rhythm to guide Brave Emperor home on just his second start. Brave Emperor in the Pale Blues getting the message late on. It's fairly charging down the centre of the course into the last hundred yards. As Spirito and Brave Emperor now moving through together, and Brave Emperor, Doyle delivers a double. Brave Emperor from an unpromising position wears down a Spirito. Vote D for Sam Twiston Davis' power back ride on Bally Milan at Worcester. Twiston Davis was patient throughout the race, tracking the leading pair. As the race unfolded, the duo found themselves in contention for the lead, but the race was far from won. In a thrilling finish, Twiston Davis cajoled his mount to victory in typical fashion. Being hard ridden, ten in between. Bally Milan is over towards the far side. They got just over half a furlong to go. Is Tedham narrowly? Bally Milan. He's staying on tenaciously. Johnny B can't go on. Bally Milan and Tedham are fighting it out. Bally Milan staying on and wins. Tremendous ride by Sam Twiston Davis. Vote E for Tom Scudamore's brilliant recovery on My Lady Grey at Newton Abbott. It was a rocky start to the race with the Grey bumping into her rivals not once but twice at the first two flights, causing her rider at one point to lose his stirrup. With Scudamore recovered, the pair still had the whole field to pass, but they did just that in great style, winning by 13 lengths. But over the last, My Lady Grey, who was well backed, a couple of early incidents put her on the back foot, but Tom Scudamore moved her to the outside, she made her way through the field, and she's going to run out a wide margin winner. Joe Tizard continues in great form, My Lady Grey being wet and windy. To vote for your May Ride of the Month, simply visit atraces.com forward slash ride. Voting closes at 11pm on Sunday the 12th of June.